everybody. This is my new cork board. Non cork board. I found it through YouTube, which it's going to be on my page. If you guys want to check it out, I'm posting this on all of my sites. And you could find uh, my page through my Instagram account. It has my link on it. Vice versa, my other ones. If there's something to click, click on it. And you can see how I did this. I went to the dollar store and I actually found the same exact poster board that she actually had on her video. And um, it actually has five sheets. So I only had to do two for this. And if you look really closely, you can't even tell that there's like another piece there that I glued. Um, because I did it. I picked out the one, I think it's right here, but I picked out the one that was very symmetrical and it matched perfectly together. So I did that and then I, um, this is what the material is made out of. It's, it's like a styrofoam. It's next to the poster board at the dollar store. They're only a buck for a big huge piece and I have that and some scraps left. And what I did is that I measured out the back of this frame. This is an old picture frame I had. And I took, I popped this off, which now it's glued, so I can't do that anymore. But I popped this off, and then I measured out the styrofoam to be the shape of the back of the picture frame, because I knew that was going to sit into the picture frame. I did um, two layers of the styrofoam material, and then I put it into the picture frame, and then I put this over it and all I didn't even use a hot glue and as you can tell it is pretty in there all I used was um I used some Elmer's glue and a stick glue so you don't even have to get like your hands all burnt and peely which some of them recommend using a glue glue um hot glue gun I'm not sure you know if it'll be as durable but for now it's good for me and um as you can see, I'm really pulling here. And it's still there. So that's good. It hangs by this thing. You can use any picture frame, either one at a dollar store. But I recommend if you have one that you love and you just don't know what to do with it, you pop out the glass. Mine actually broke, so I ended up using this um, for it because the glass broke. I didn't know what else to do with it because I couldn't do a picture in it anymore because of the glass breaking. So, um... I bought this at the Dollar Tree, and same with the uh, styrofoam board. And you can find cute push pins of different things. Mine's going to be more of like, I think, a memory type of thing or places I want to go and travel. I did find this cute assortment at Walmart. It was like three or four bucks, but if I decided just to get like three out of the four items, it ended up being more money to, um, let me try to get this open for you guys. Ah, there we go. Ended up being more money if I just picked two items instead of all three items. You've got paper clips, push pins, which are really fun different colors. Um, that was just an added bonus. You can add stuff to it because it divides, which I like. And there's all different color little smiley face clips, which are really cute. And you can find them at the in the school supply section. And um, let me try to grab one with my condition it's hard to use my fingers and stuff but as you can tell there's like cute little smiley face on them they clip um i might do some rope but i'm gonna try the push pins first so we're gonna try one right now and as you can tell it works and it's awesome so that is two layers of the styrofoam board which i mean as you could tell it is pretty thick obviously it's thicker than poster board and that's why it is staying in there which is awesome so i love that idea that i got um from youtube and the video is under my videos that i saved so you have that and then i also might want to tie like a rope or something 